بحب إني هيك أغيب عن الدنيا بحكي إني أنا ما بعرف إني أفوت في غيب أوف يعني يا ريت أفوت في غيب أوف كل شيء في الشو حوالي دي بس بطل هذا حق يعني مش عايز بس Eba was under interrogation for 15 days without knowing the charges against her. Then she was taken to the military court for an extension of detention without being allowed to see a lawyer. They accused her to be a member of the Islamic Jihad party and that she had organized demonstrations. At that time, she was working for an organization that supported Palestinian political prisoners. She was put in a solitary confinement, underground, no windows, very small. She told me she never knew what time it was, whether it was day or night. She refused to eat and went on a hunger strike because she wanted to know the reason why she was there. I used to uh, to uh, uh, the occupation around the house and what happened every time problem with the settlers, with the Jewish, with the army. Someone can have a problem, but what are you doing? Nothing. This my house, house my family. I can't leave this house and my family can't leave because not uh, 
not found other place, other house, and all think uh, difficult, difficult if I if my family wanted buy other uh, house or uh, other uh, land. After a stone hit her head, Ayat fell on the ground. The ambulance arrived after two hours and a half. When her father asked why they came so late, they said they had been stopped at the checkpoint all that time. Two months after the accident, Ayat still feels the effects of it. Sometimes she cries without a reason. Sometimes she suddenly loses attention and didn't get the job as a teacher she was waiting for. I'm <laughs> 